hello everyone you are welcome back to my channel in today's tutorial we're going to be learning how to make this beautiful sleeve so first and first I've already cut out the fabric I'm going to be needing for the sleeve I have it on fold so the first thing I'm going to do now is to bring my my dress and measure my arm around because I want, I'm going to fix my sleeve before shipping out the dress so after measuring I have 12 inches as you can see 12 inches so I'll keep that aside so the first thing to do now is to measure the length of this half sleeve which is 11 inches plus extra 1 inches making 12 inches that is for joining back so after that I'll use a long ruler to draw a straight line to serve as a guideline the next thing to do now is to measure half of our arm hole measurement, which is 12 inches. The half of 12 inches is 6 inches. That is what I measured there. Then we'll go over to the edge and measure 3.5 inches. I came down by 3.5 inches. Then I'm going to draw my curve. Remember, it's an arm hole, so it needs to be curved. Just using the 6 inches, we mark it as a guideline. You can see the curve. So after that, we'll come down to the round sleeve measurement. My round sleeve is 11 inches. Divide by 2 is 5.5 inches plus extra 1 inches for sewing allowance. So here, I'm just trying to measure the curve, making sure I have 12 inches exactly to avoid shortage and excess as well. You can see I have 12 inches directly. So I'm just trying to confirm the measurement again. I have 12 inches exactly. So I'm just going to use my ruler and connect the points together. Then after that, I'll cut out. Then after cutting out, we'll give it a notch at the down part and the upper part as well. So for the down part, the full sleeve length is 20 inches. The half sleeve was 11 so 20 minus 11 is 9 inches plus my allowance I have 10 inches so the width I have 15 inches on fold so that is why open is going to be 30 inches so this is how it is so I'm just going going to give the down part the guidance like so so let's go over to the sewing machine if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do where to click on the subscribe button thank you so after gathering, this is how it looks like. So the next thing to do now is to join it to the upper part of the sleeve using half of an inch. And why haven't you liked this video yet? Please click on the like button and also subscribe. I'm saying it again. Please subscribe to my channel. Turn on your notification bell to be notified when I upload new videos. And after stitching so mate, this is how it looks like. This is how beautiful it's looking like. So the next thing to do now is just to, is to join the sleeves together. This is the inside part using one inch. And this is it. Make sure you open your seams while stitching. You can see so it can balance at the outside part. You can see the outside part. Look at the lines meeting perfectly. Can see so the next thing for us to do now is to aim the down part of the sleeve just aim it a little bit you can see and this is how the sleeves look like you can see how beautiful it is looking you can see and this is the final look this is it after fixing it to the dress this is how beautiful it's looking if you find this video helpful please do well to like and subscribe if you have any question, you can leave it in the comment section. Bye!